Oh, nice. The game's starting. Well, welcome to What Remains of Edith Fitch. I'm Dev. I'll be playing the game today. And this is just a game that I've had in my library from PlayStation Plus, and I have not played it forever. Or haven't played it yet. So I'm looking forward to it. And I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh, hey. Journal. Okay, so I'm Edith, I'm guessing. Okay. A lot of this isn't going to make sense to you. And I'm sorry about that. I'm just going to start at the beginning with the house. All right, now I'm moving. Cool. <laughs> Starting at the house. That's the house. That looks like something from Harry Potter. Like a I Dursley here style house. I was 11, but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Okay. Huh. Cool. Very pretty. What does that say? Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago. Marked urgent. Open immediately. <laughs> seven years ago. Okay, so that's an old ass house. Nobody's been in here since. I hadn't been back since my brother Lewis's funeral. Oh, that's sad. I'm sorry. Get out of my way. <laughs> Get out of my way, letters. Are they still there? They're still. Oh, now they're gone. Cool. You know, Will, my mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. Mm -hmm. Maybe she thought I'd know. Or she thought the mystery would be enough to bring me back. The mystery. Got left a key, gotta go find what's inside. Covering my hands cause it's cold. <laughs> oh, it's so much better. No one had driven this way in a long time, but I saw a few hoofprints. You have prints, cool. Anyway, uh, well, can't see. There we go. Whoop. <gasps> Hi there, <laughs> cute. The truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. But now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. Cool. Um, wow. That's a... Uh, house was exactly like I remembered it. Gigantic house. About it. That is... I... That... I mean, that looks like my house. <laughs> no, that is a cool house. Holy moly. No, go to the house. Oh, I am going the wrong way. Just looking up like, wow, that's a cool house. Blah, just splash in the water. Oh, there's froggies too. I love frogs. Frogs are cool. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. <laughs> Were you at the very top where it looks like it could just topple over? Now, as a 17-year-old, I knew exactly <laughs> what those words were. I am 17 I now. I know everything. <laughs> I was afraid of the house. Oh, boy. I hope the key might unlock the front door. Hell no. <laughs> Who was home? I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. Hmm. Nope, nope. There we go. Okay, so I guess we have to have a look around elsewhere. And this is dark, hang on. And that is a smidge better. Okay. Zoom in L1. Doesn't tell me any of the controls. Oh, zoom in is L1. L2 is zoom in. <laughs> um, let's see what else there is. Triangle is the pause button again. And, oh, cool. It's a little family tree. Oh, Edith is cute. So she was born in 1999. And then we have Odin. What, like, fucking Odin, the god of thunder? 
Walter, uh, Eddie, Sam, Calvin, Barbara, Molly, Greg, Gaston, Sanjay. Who's Sanjay? I want to know who Sanjay is. Milton, Lewis, and Edith. Everyone else is dead. Except for me. <laughs> Edith Finch. Okay. Wow. So, a little bleak there. I can see why she would get the house, because no one else in the family would. But wait. Damn it! No! <laughs> Don't do that! I... I can't move fast. I don't think. That's what I was trying to do. And I can't. Oh well. Uh, how about the back way? Wow, this house is cool. I love it. Gonna have a way into the garage, maybe? No. Wind chimes. Pretty. Key to the back door. Yeah. Oh, dog door. I could try that too, I guess. Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. Awesome. Oh. Forgot to set my timer. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Wow. Okay, so this is the garage. Um, I don't think there's of anything important in here. So we will go. Wait, no. That's where we just came through. How? <laughs> where... <laughs> where do I go? Oh, yeah. There's a door right here. For the first time in years, Whoop. I felt like I was home. Dang, that's a lot of books. Everywhere. But instead of a family, there were just memories of There are fucking dirty dishes. <laughs> they all left me. This is bullshit. <laughs> Ooh, like how after Lewis started working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon. Except our cat, mm. Molly. <laughs> Yum. Wait. L.P. Brown Keenery. What is it? Oh, I was expecting like an expiration date. Oh, we got tuna apple pie. <laughs> Alright, cool. Lewis Finch, in loving memory, beloved brother to Edith, son of Don, great grandson to Eddie, memorial service. Edith, Eddie, Don, and Lewis. Wait, that's me. Wait, am I black? <laughs> Hang on. Ah! Too close. Uh, okay. Edith. Wait. Okay, so that's Eddie. Lewis. And who was it? Lewis. Wait. Oh, Edie. The grandma I was like, Eddie, grandma? Uh, grandma Eddie. And then Lewis. Okay, so Lewis. Brother. He looked pretty cool. He had a little goatee. <laughs> He's a cool dude. That's what he'll be remembered for. Being cool. All the time. The table was still a wreck from the night we left. It was like a bomb had gone off. When killing everybody. everyone but sparing the furniture. <gasps> What? <laughs> Killing everyone? What the hell happened? And why are there so many books? Nothing in the this house. Family loved to read. Normal. There was just too much of it, like a Ooh. smile with too many teeth. Who was that? <laughs> As they say, fighting back a gun. Great Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara, along with the rest of the house. Okay. So we got that going on <laughs> now. Creepy music. Well, why is everyone left dead? Behind in the whirlwind of that last night. I need to know what happened. Why is this door locked and completely pasted shut? That's spooky. Okay, and then somebody, what, Edie was probably in a wheelchair. 
so many books. We got <laughs> Vikings Billy, Raw Fowl. I can't read the rest, <laughs> which is King Pacific Coast Seafood. This is just like a lot of fucking Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. See cookbooks. Then Edie retaliated and drilled Ooh. peepholes. Ow. Made you like Ooh. Butterflies. Cool. What? <laughs> what? What? Why? Who? What? No. Anyway. Jeez, that's a lot of pictures. Um. What was I supposed to do? Gregory? As a oh. kid, I just assumed every house had peepholes and sealed <laughs> rooms you weren't allowed inside of. What? The hell? Is going on? And that's a bathroom. And it's pink and fuzzy. And it's for Gregory. My Calvin. grandpa Sam spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother. <gasps> Calvin. What? Like, just while he was in the room with him? The last time I was in Edith Sr.'s room, I was ten and she was painting my portrait. <laughs> this is crazy. I love that door. It's so cute. Wow, these all have... These are all awesome doors. I want doors like those. And about, like, just piles of books everywhere. <laughs> Keep books in a neat, safe area. Jeez. Oh, Ooh, it's up here. Mom must have locked the third floor stairs on the night we left. Okay... <laughs> Barbara! Barbara was a child star for two years. Ooh. Until America grew out of it. Oh, poor Barbara. To be young and famous. That's scary. <laughs> Molly? Molly Ooh. always seemed like a girl I could imagine being friends with. That's if a she pretty had died room. In 1947. Right. That's so weird that they just kept her room just for like they just seal the doors. You can never go inside. I spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. Ooh. Wow. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Why why are they sealing it up though? Just to preserve it? He always told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, snap. Turns out my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Oh, snap. Oh, yeah, I gotta turn it. Gasp. I wanted to read that book. Ooh. Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. What? I could have just pulled it up without the handle, but whatever. What the hell? Oh, but you wouldn't have noticed it. From the I got, on the wall, it's clear my brother Milton had been here before me. Milton? Mr. Reading Cat this, Milton? Maybe it sounds like I had a plan. But I, but didn't. I had no idea what was behind that door. <sighs> Gasp. It's gonna be a zombie. <laughs> Just like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. Oh dear. Um. Where is this going to lead? Molly? What are you hiding, Molly? And what the heck is that thing on your dresser? Is it... What? Just, just a random toy caterpillar. It just looks scary. December 13th, 1947. Dear Diary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's going to happen. It started when Mom sent me to bed without dinner. I woke up and I was starving, so I looked around for something to eat. What? No, Molly? Okay, cool. Uh, the let's eat the hamster dry, food. But I didn't mind it. Uh, yum, okay. 
Where's the gerbil? Why is the gerbil out? Oh my god. <laughs> Should I eat the fishies? Can I eat them? Can I really? I thought about... I thought about eating Christopher. <gasps> no! Yeah, don't. I was kidding. All right, you thought about it, huh? Why, though? <laughs> Just because. And... Dissecting starfish. Okay. So, is the room still sealed? Pumpkin. My Halloween candy was all gone. Son of a bitch. I hate that feeling. <laughs> Mom, can I come out now? <laughs> it's late. Go to sleep. But it's 12.30 in the afternoon, Mom. <laughs> All right, well, oh. I'll cut it short right there. Oh, I'll oh. <laughs> cut it short on the episode here. This is freaky story anyway. Uh, thanks for watching.